Come on, you fuck. Yeah, see, told you, fuck it up. That was a difficult bus lane to pull into. And I said to Kerry, I'll, I'll wait for it to come up. No, one fucking brake light working properly, and the other one's got a fucking wiper blade in it. I said to Kerry, I, and I said I'd, I'd cut that up from the bidding because I'd bid and found out what his highest bid was, and then it jumped. I was like, oh shit. And then like in the last few seconds I said to her, well, it's got to be worth 95 quid because I pay that to, to get to get to get in it. And it's only 86 quid. Or 81 quid, one or two. And it's had everything with it. Which is more than what you're going to get with some of them. Normally they've only just got the camera. And you can hear there in his voice, he's, he's very worried about this particular issue. And of course he is just one person. Maybe and the pounds case is just one case. But looking at some figures released last year from the Ministry of Justice that show that the number of pupils carrying a knife to school has gone up. There were 118 Tom incidents of pupils that were caught with knives off. in 2014. This went up to 206 in 2015. 18 of these were in London. Uh, despite this increase, well, though, the Department of Education told me that these cases are still very rare and they're really sure that schools modern. are safe places and reiterated to me that teachers are in charge of discipline and they can serve people without consent. Did, did I mishear it? Did you say that once? You're going to fucking all those people. I'm going to go in front of you. 